Welcome ladies and gentlemen. What's going on tonight? Uh, tonight I'm just playing, of course, and as usual, uh, making a mess. As you see, the workbench is fully covered. And at the side, it's almost clean, as you can see. I was fighting with that almost whole uh, afternoon. And did clean up the top bench. Uh, did clean up the middle shelf. There's still something under like buckets of wires, bucket of stainless and I have no idea what what else can be behind. Anyway, I'm gonna clean those up and as you know, uh, I did order a piece of equipment for, for myself for further play and and just have fun together with that. So I got to rebuild the area in here a little bit uh, I get rid of this tiny little lap corner from here because uh, anyway it wasn't a good idea having the self lap or chemicals boiling next to the spot where I used to be without any uh, let's say fume hood and, whatso or fume hood and whatsoever so I'm gonna go back to my main uh, lab with all that chemical stuff and so on and here actually I'm gonna set up uh, some uh, soldering station and electronic play playground, let's call it playground. And yeah, I'm gonna remove that ventilation from here. Uh, as well you can see the chemicals work a little bit on that little guy. So that's almost finished. And yeah, for the soldering and that stuff I will also need a ventilation. And this is actually quite corner where I can use those tiny pipe and just exhaust the fumes outside. Anyway, uh, <clears throat> I do remove from here plenty, plenty stuff. I have no idea how much uh, stuff I can fit in such a small area. Anyway, uh, let's grab this on the way as I go in there and let's move to the, oh, there is some stuff what I remove, uh, burner, steerer, and some melting stuff in there. So I'm gonna go back to the original lab what I prepared like long long time ago but at some point uh, my fume hood get broken and yeah I need to move to another spot uh, plus I got like extra fun what taking out all the fumes that one is big little guy so it can like blow in or suck away the stuff from the self lab anyway that's the lab what I prepared like some time ago, as you can see. But unfortunately, uh, my fume hood in here doesn't work anymore, and it gets like a little bit. Uh, they turn into a little bit storage area, but yeah, that's gonna change because yeah, all those chemical stuff got to be done in the right spots. Oh dang! As you can see. Uh, fumes doesn't uh, make any problems for the spiders as you can see yeps there was another fume tiny little fun what was running in here that was just emergency one just to the finish up the projects what was going on and as you can see there was not so much activity for some time and yeah everything uh, gets like rusty and broken anyway so, uh, that's gonna be something to work on uh, soon because I need to run uh, some kind of extra pipe because this is what I use so far it's not available because I was doing something over that room and yeah, anyway, never mind, that's the lab I'm gonna come back in here with all those chemical thingy as you can see there's still some some project on the on the run well I didn't finish or get stuck and have no idea what to do with the with it later on but anyway yep all those stuff uh, some of that thing it comes from the downstairs some of the thing was here for uh, plenty time and yeah let's go back to clean up what we got uh, down there no there's something interesting I don't know, don't remember. Anyway, 
ya. Oh, look what I found! Full pack of cigarettes. Cool. <laughs> I forget about that. And yeah, that's a little bit of storage and materials what I what I gonna process at some point. So here you got pluggies and transistors, and memory, RAMs, more pluggies, 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 and MOSFETs, some small stuff, IC chip, looks like phone board, more boxes with the materials, uh, what's that? Something, logic boards I guess, yeah that's logic boards. Hmm. Another box with the memories. Oh, that's the silver stuff in here. Nice and shiny. That's silver contacts. Probably it's quite dark in here, but yeah. Anyway, boxes all over the place. So I need to repair my lab and yeah, get uh, get it back into the functional way. So yeah, let's go back <coughs> and continue on on the self corner out there hmm of course pile of scrap what's waiting to be taken apart hmm tiny sneak peek on the stickers bom, bom, bom. cool stuff oh Full box of extruded alu. All good, all good. Let's go back to the main cave. And in the main cave, there are some rules. Tool rule. Home. <clears throat> so, uh, the plan is. To get rid of all that board place from here and make it the same level as this one here it's about I don't know 15 centimeter lower get rid of that shielding continue with that level all the way up to here somehow some somewhere about here how is the plate yeah, it's end up in here so that will be good and then I will have like tiny shelving here. Maybe I can put the screen in here. One screen. Plus we'll got more space for more screens for this PC. And somewhere I will drop this thingy somewhere there. And maybe some tiny boxes like like so. Those tiny shelvings and so on. And Yep, that's the plan for now. Uh, right now I am on cleaning and yeah, we'll all see what's come out of that. So after I finish up cleaning, rebuilding and cutting and making it back together. So see you for now. That's gonna be I bet few evenings for me and few seconds for you guys. So see you then. Boom, welcome back ladies and gents. So after a little fight with all that, uh, as you can see, everything is like uh, mainly, mainly done. So, all the same level. Boom, boom, boom. This drawer was moved to this side. And yeah, of course, I lose a little bit stability in here, but I'm not gonna use it as a, uh, let's say anvil or something so that's gonna be cool I guess otherwise I will work on something so what else I need to do hmm, I don't know set up all the machines at the self place maybe get rid of that uh, shelvings or racks on the wall and yeah who knows maybe I will go with another shelving because actually this one uh, fit with this one and I can continue on a little bit further but I'm not sure yet we will all see and under I was thinking to add tiny little shelving as you can see there's still something to screw on and here there will be nothing uh, standing in the way 
to put like short shelving behind just to storage space and fill it up with hundreds of boxes tiny ones and yep so that's the look for now this bench getting slightly bigger so that's all cool and yeah i think i'm gonna end up uh, this video at this point and just make part one or something like that anyway uh, later on yeah we'll see after i begin to set up the gear and stuff and the thingies so uh, either way i continue on that one with that video or just start another part of that so see you then so far so good and yeah as far as you like it so see you all at the next one bye for now